What's going on guys, it's your boy Sam from Sammy CBD TV coming at you with another one on this beautiful morning. It's 9.37 a.m. February 24th, aka my second day off, you know, just chilling, just enjoying my day off, man, you know. <clears throat> Today I bring you Cherry Cobbler, guys. It's an indoor strain. It's an indoor hybrid, too, so it looks phenomenal. Nice and moist. Nothing's really dry. But look at that, the sun's really hit. Too bad I can't focus in, on, in the, when it's in the sun. This is the indoor cherry. Look at that, it looks crazy when it's in the sun. <laughs> but check that out, guys. So it looks gorgeous. Guys, this is a really nice color green. It is covered in trichomes. But you already knew that, right? You already knew that. Wow, it smells true to the name. Kind of smells like the uh, Plain Jane Indoor Cherry. That had that funky cherry-like smell to it. That one was pretty good and all. I don't know. I personally wasn't mind blown by it. The effects were good. I mean, it wasn't bad. I'm not gonna sit there and say it was terrible, but my initial my initial response I had with it was so it was strange when I smoked it out of the bong. That's why I thought something was wrong with it. Is because it was like sizzling and carrying on and making all these weird noises and I don't know. And it tasted artificial. Like I can't even explain it to you guys. I've also been reading articles that like a lot of companies are putting stuff in to their soil and stuff to make it taste like the plants, like the vanilla or, you know, whatever, which is a little freaky to me. It's like, why? It's... All right, guys, so let's get right into it, all right? I'm going to look up some of the specifications for y'all. Arit CBD Cherry... Cobbler. Definitely smells cherry though, I'll tell you that. Alright guys, so... Alright, it's uplifting yet relaxing, great for any time of the day. They claim here that it... it just like it smells, it tastes. Orange, chocolate, and cherries. Indoor grown cherry cobbler CBD hemp flower is flat out incredible. It is a slightly sativa dominant hybrid with a very interesting terpene profile that explains the strong pungent aroma and equally great taste. The amazing flower has extremely high levels of terpenes clocking at a 4.6% total and some of the highest we've seen of beta micrine and neurolidol. All right. It's uh, Tangistan R4 and Charlotte's cherries, 17.67% CBDA. Harvested on 9-18-2019, and it's got 0.2% Delta 9. I'll be rolling this up today in the green game. Yes, I've been smoking blunts lately because I do enjoy blunts. I always have. Except, I, like I used to say, I used to get the big ones in the tubes and take the leaf off and everything.
I don't know, guys. This this cherry smell I'm getting from this is insane. I mean, it smells just like some like artificial cherry smell. You know what I mean? Like, or maybe it's because it's the citrus and the and the it's the orange and the um, you know cherry together. Maybe that's what I'm tasting like that weird combination. But anyways, it, the point is, is that it smells it smells pretty good. So. It does not smell too bad, let me just tell you that. I'll twist it up, baby. I'm excited for this one. I'm excited. Let me get out of the sun. I'm excited for this one. All right, guys. This this is a nice cherry. A nice cherry strain, though. It smells good. Let's see, let's see, let's see what they talk about. That's what everyone on YouTube saying now. Yo, let, let's see what they talk about. For the bird, sucker. You already know what time it is, baby. <coughs> Alright, there we go. Problem solved. Alright, so... It don't taste bad, guys. Let me just let me just hit it a few more times before I. So their Electra definitely tastes better than the strain, though. This is a good tasting strain. Don't get me wrong, but that Electra was very good. I enjoyed the Electra. I love Electra. Yo, if y'all ain't never seen the reviewers Twin Tokers, go check them out, guys. They're twins. They do reviews on the same on the same screen together, and they're a trip, yo. They are a trip. They're like the perfect team. Like it's so funny. One's the other man's hype man. Like it's just great. All right, guys, so I'm getting some good taste off this. Not like I thought it was going to be. I bet it tastes really nice and good in the bong now, maybe. So, I don't know. Let's get, some, let's get some beats going on right now. Let's get some beats. <laughs> Damn, I heard there was another smoking legal out there now, man. Copying the other smoking legal. Taz. Damn, bro, you got a copycat. That sucks. Oh, I smell a seed. I smell a seed. And it's indoor. Get it. Come on, 
song, baby. Uh. Smoking CBD like what? Shit, I don't give a fuck. CBD, 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 A. THC, 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 A. Yeah, chilling in the trap. Smoking CBD. Yo, this shit fire right here. This is terrible. I hate non copyrighted music. Why did they have to block my one video? Damn. Can't a boy just listen to Wiz Khalifa when he's smoking? Damn. Sorry, but I don't know how you would like, you know. Trying it. It's an indoor. 
Palm Ridge. You got a problem with me? Come on, man. This Sammy CBD likes you. I don't give a fuck. Smoking CBD in my club. Yo, this shit is fire. You gotta try that. Indoor cherry cobbler, homie. This shit is straight throbbing in my throat, nigga. Cause I'm coughing. Got a problem with me? Get lost. In it. It's like, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I ain't no rapper, dude. I'm just being dumb. Guys, the strain is very good, though. This shit is good. Now I'm ready to go clean my whole car. Let's do it. <laughs> Yo, for real. Come back. I better put this shit out before I go paint my whole house. For real. But I can't. Because I love CBD. What? What what should I name my channel, man? Shit, come on, let me think. Sammy C B D. Hey! <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking with y'all, man. Alright y'all. I'm out. Thanks for tuning in guys. So far the strain's gonna get a pure 10 out of 10 on effects. This shit'll have you jacked up, boy. Ready to go lift some weights and shit. This is a very strong strain. As far as like energy, I'm feeling an amazing source of energy right now. Like, I don't like it. All right. All right. All right. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Um. Sight. Yeah. So, anyways, guys, check it out. Arit CBD, man. They just unveiled that they got some new hydroponic strains coming out and shit. Like. Supposedly some of the best in the game. They made the announcement They got some hydroponic stuff man. That's gonna be fire And I'm gonna buy it all Oh, there we go. I got my watch on now, you know, so I know what time it is cuz right now I think it's smoke time <laughs> right Oh man Anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. I thought I had something else to review. I don't remember. I'm sure I do somewhere. And when I find it, I uh, will let you know. When I find what, I, what else I'm supposed to review, I will let you know. Because that's the kind of guy I am. I mean, I'm such a good guy, man. You know? Yo, I can't believe... Yo, hold on, man. I gotta show you all this, man. Yo, I got these. Yo, I got these on Valentine's Day, right? Look. They are still pumped up. Nothing. Can you believe? Hey, yo. Hey, this is the crazy thing about it, right? I didn't get those from like anywhere like Wise Markets or any grocery stores or anywhere professional or whatever. The Dollar Tree has the best helium in the game. Let me just tell you that. Yo, gentlemen, if you're looking to get your lady something, man, go to the Dollar Tree and get her some balloons. Them bitches last for weeks. I'm talking about, like, yo, there's so, there's so much helium in them. Look, they're hugging the ceiling like they're begging to get out. Damn. What? Yo, that's crazy, though. Anyways, guys, like, comment, subscribe, click the bell. I got some good stuff coming out, man. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna go all in, homie. I'm gonna start ordering left and right. I'm a murderer. I'll be smoking, but I'm only gonna buy grams of some stuff, man. You know why? Because I've been thinking about this. Like, yo, like I'm sitting on, I just got shit sitting around my house and stuff. Like, I could choose whatever strain I want for however I'm feeling in that very day. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got that little bit left. But then I got like, I got so much CBD. I don't know. All right, guys, I'm out. Thanks for tuning in. I will see y'all later for another review.
I'm not sure who yet. Mm, let me think about it. I'll get back to you. All right, y'all.